Welcome back. You're watching CNN News 18 with me, Griha. Now we're getting some more breaking news. As per government sources, Rahul Gandhi has now refused to take up the bungalow that has been allotted to him after he has been reinstated as a member of parliament. Rahul Gandhi refused to take the 12th Tughlaq Lane bungalow as his official bungalow. Remember, this was the place where he was staying on earlier, which he had to relinquish uh, when he was, in fact, uh, disqualified as MP. And now he, we are told, has wanted the 7 Safdar Jung Road bungalow, which the government is not very keen on allotting to him. Now remember, former Congress President Rahul Gandhi, in fact, was already looking at options uh, for his bungalow after relinquishing 12 Tughlaq Lane after his disqualification as Member of Parliament. Now that he has been reinstated, uh, he will be allotted that bungalow. He, in fact, was given 12 Tughlaq Lane back. He was also asked to respond to this uh, within eight days, whether he would be wanting the same house or not. But we are being told that he's more keen on 7 Safdar Jung Road bungalow, which he now wants to take up. My colleague Pallavi is uh, with us on the broadcast. Pallavi, uh, why the sudden need to not go back to the residence that uh, Rahul was staying earlier in? Well, if you just believe the Congress party, there are many who believed that a 12th Tukluk Lane perhaps was not a very auspicious house for Rahul Gandhi. And we do know politicians are very, very careful about these kind of situations. So when he vacated 12th Tukluk Lane, we also saw the huge uh, 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 movement which Rahul Gandhi put forward, uh, where he said that, you know, this is, a, uh, th this is a house which was given to me by the people who voted me to par. And I remember even after he had to vacate the house and shift into 10, ja 10 Janpal, which is his mother's residence, he would often say at a public platform that I don't have any attachment to any property. I don't even a house in our name. But what we are now picking up by way of the government sources is that when he was returned back 12 to Clark Lane after his disqualification was put on hold, uh, he also was offered a return back to his earlier residence, which is 12 to Clark Lane. Instead, the word which came in from the party and a request was that he should be given seven Savdajag Lane instead. That is something from the general pool. So they're very quickly to put the word in. There are two pools from which you are given accommodation, the MPs are given. Mm -hmm. The Rajya Sabha for the Rajya Sabha MPs, the Lok Sabha for the Lok Sabha MPs and the ultimate prerogative is the general pool. That is where the Urban Development Ministry or the Housing Committee also steps in. This request was put in for this particular accommodation from the general pool but the government sources are telling us is that's not really possible. He has the choice of going back to 12 Tukluk Lane. If he doesn't want to take it up then so be it. And these technicalities, if we have to take into consideration, I also believe that he only had about eight days to respond to this allotment that has been given back to him. What happens beyond that eight days if he's not choosing to go back to 12th Tughlaq Lane? Well, if the request then comes in for the same accommodation from someone else, then that accommodation, of course, goes across to the person. You also have to give it in writing that I reject this particular accommodation for whatever reason. Then it is opened up for uh, allotment, which means it goes into a general pool. It can be opened up for allotment for any other MP or anyone else who wants to uh, move into that particular residence. But I think that very it's very clear that for whatever reason or otherwise, which the Congress party is not going to talk about very openly, is the fact that he doesn't want to go back to 12 Tukluk Lane. It's been almost two to three months, if I'm not mistaken, since hmm. his disqualification has been put on hold. And uh, yet Rahul Gandhi continues to operate out of 10 Janpat. He holds his meetings over there. Uh, he that's his mother's residence, hmm. uh, which was given to her. And uh, so he, his request, special request for an allotment from the general pool for 7 Sadhajang Lane, however, has not been accepted by the government. Right, Pallavi, thank you so much for all of those details there on this uh, breaking piece of information.